welcome back to another episode of Deep Dive into the Census. Batman Dam. We all know about this hot book, right? So take a look at this. Can you imagine the very first copy submitted got a 10? Look at this. October 2nd, 2018. And look at how fast things ramp up. Yes, this book is not was not print in huge number, okay? Yes, we all know that. But still, look at how fast it ramped up. This video was shot on November 15th. No, December. My apology. This video was shot on December 15th. Depending on when I load it, who knows. But that's how you can date it. By, by the time I load this video, the census may have doubled. I doubt it. And let me tell you why I doubt that the census will double. First off, 10.0 jump from 1 to 136. And you can see there are 263, 9.9, 391.9.8. Forget the rest. Okay, but look at this. Even signature series, look at that. There are... 39, yes, 39, 10.0. Insanity, right? Indeed, insanity. So, can anybody guess how the book performed? Let's go to GPA. Okay. As I mentioned many times in many previous videos, especially on hot books, okay? Price can move fast in both direction. Let's take a look. Let's take a look at nine point. Let's, let's, let's go to 10.0 first. 10.0, here we go. The very first copy right off the bat sold for 1100. Yeah, look at that. And then even Five copies later, five copies later, someone paid up to eleven thirty six. Sure, twelve fifty is a high, but can you guess what has happened to the price of the ten point oh since November, since the end of October? Take a look, eight hundred and ninety nine. It is never seen. Again, that price never seen again since. Look at that. Look at that. 381 December 8. Give or take, there's a couple copies on the same day 400, 447, 500, but it bottomed so far at 381. Two months after it first sold at eleven hundred. Wow. How about nine point nine? What do you think happened? Here we go. Nine point nine. First copy sold October eight five ninety. Care to see or guess what happened over the past six weeks? There you go. Look at that. Look at the precipitous decline. Goodness gracious. Even 9.9. 150. Okay. If you take a look here at the chart up there on the right side on the 10.0, similar fate to the 9.9. .9. There we look at 9.8. Once again, October 2nd. First copy, $300. Okay, you can take a look at the chart on the right, okay, and see the precipitous decline right there to roughly 100. So let's see. It keeps dropping slowly, even dropped to 86. That's the lowest. Oh, 83, 84.
there's plenty of prices below 100 okay plenty and seem like it found perhaps perhaps found the bottom around 100 to 115 there you go all three all three grades suffer the same fate so what's the lesson here the lesson is if you're dealing with moderns if you're dealing with hot books i don't care if there are 3,000 copies, 10,000 copies, whatever it is, when it is hot, you better pony up for express grading. Pay the extra $9 or $7 or whatever it is the CGC will charge you so that you can get this thing done and graded in a quicker time frame because you need to hit the market quick. Okay, you, when you talk about a 10.0 going from 1100 all the way down to 400 it's huge the saving of eight or nine or ten dollar on submitting either modern or express modern is the difference between 400 or 800 okay it's, it's, it's a huge difference i can't say enough about you know people that want to speculate to play in the modern flipping arena, you better not be cheap. You better be quick on your feet because if you sit there and hold on to the book one day, one week too long, it's over, okay? It's over on many ways. Yes, is it over completely? Absolutely not. If you bought the books for 10 bucks, five bucks, whatever it is, cover price, it's not a bad thing to have, but how do you think the people that race, race to be first to have feel? In the hobby of comic books, being first is not a strategy, okay? This is not a contest. This is not a competition. Be the first one to own a 9.9 or 10.0 or 9.8 in this situation turn out to be what? You can fill in the blank, okay? <laughs> you can fill in the blank of what you call those that like to be first. This is not a race, people. Okay? Not a race at all. And I can't stress enough that, you know, when I come down to this hobby, I can't understand. I'm not in that mindset. I don't understand the mindset of those that approach it like it's some kind of contest or competition. Because it, it doesn't make any sense to me. But hey, I can't speak for other people. But now that you see how the price precipit precipitously declined in those grades over the past two months, I will predict that because of that decline, you will see a substantially slower submission for this book. I will revisit I will revisit this book down the line, maybe two months down the road, just to see if my prediction is right. And if so, what happened to the price? Okay, ultimately, right now, everybody that needed, wanted, must have, got to have a 10.0 or 9.9, .9, they already got a copy. Okay, just, just take a look on eBay. The wonderful thing about GPA is right here is all the books that are for sales just look is anybody holding on to these books right now the supplies is crushing the demand that's why the price dropped like a lead so we'll see look at this it's a wall and <laughs> there are just as many copies for sales as Available that was slapped from the look of it, right? It's insane. Silly. Anyhow, enough of my ranting. Thanks for watching. I will keep my eyes very close on this book to see how it will perform, whether supplies will decline so that demand can catch up and the price can improve, or it flatlined.